Whoa, 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 what is this? This isn't Black Ops, this isn't First Strike, this isn't my AK-74U or from Moss, what is this? And what's this silly black banana gun I'm holding in my hand? Well sir, that is a Type 99 and this isn't Black Ops. This is Call of Duty World at War, you know, Treyarch's previous Call of Duty game and one of my personal favorites. When I'm in the mood to play Call of Duty, when I got that Call of Duty, uh, that Call of Duty feeling, I guess, I don't know, urge, no, that's, that's too deep. Uh, anyway, uh, this guy with his, like, MP4 is just shooting at me, and I really am not in the mood for that, so I'm just gonna explode him with a Granada, with a Granada, and, uh, what's up, guys, Jeff here, and this is World at War, I love this Call of Duty, it is a lot of fun to play. I'm playing on Snazzy because I really dig leveling up and prestiging in these older Call of Duty games. Um, the perks I'm running today are Juggernauts, and the reason I run Juggernaut is not because of snipers, but because of MP40 ears. Uh, I can't stand the one-shot headshot, stopping power, MP40 thing, so I just run Juggernauts. I don't mind shooting a few more bullets, and actually right here it's a little 1v1 situation. I chuck my signal flare because this ain't Alan Wake, baby. Um, I'm gonna hop over here and I'm using bazookas actually. Actually, I like this little move right here. I'm like a little sneaky beaver. I get up on the fence and I line up the shot and get the easy headshot. Um, but yeah, I'm using bazookas because nobody ever expects those. Like, legitimately, nobody uses bazookas in this game but me. I've never actually ran into another person in like the past six months that has used bazooka in a search and destroy game so it really throws them off guard and these bazookas aren't amazing but sometimes I do some pretty awesome stuff with them uh, I don't think I do anything too crazy this game but they're a lot of fun to use nobody sees them coming and they're a little bit different you know mix it up you know variety is the spice of life and then I got the bayonet on my my type 99 so I do like the whole Japanese suicide bonsai run or whatever um, this is Courtyard, and this is pretty fast-paced S&D, you know, there's never really a moment where things are chill and you can kind of camp it out. Uh, usually when I play this map, I sit at spawn for a minute, though, to avoid, you know, the starting nades. And because I have, I don't have bomb squad, I'm, like, heavily careful around going around corners and stuff. Um, uh, in my head I'm saying, nobody, nobody, nobody. Because <laughs> I really don't want to get killed by Bettys because I feel like I got cheated to death or whatever. And I raped that guy with a pistol. I mean, there's lots of counters to Betty's in this game, but they are OP. I mean, that's a fact. Um, flag jacket, you know, bomb squad, I like that. But it's just fun to kind of mix it up, you know. You can't always see Betty's. It's kind of like, oh, God, no Betty. Actually, right here, there's two people rushing to the right side, which does happen sometimes. I zooker that guy, and my game lags when I shoot bazookas for some reason. I have no idea why it does that. I don't know. My internet's hella weird. I recently upgraded it uh, from like 3 download and 3 upload to 15 upload and download. And I think that guy got a clout with a trench gun back there. I don't know, I need to watch it again. But uh, yeah, I upgraded my internet and that's pretty boss. Um, and then my ping, it's it's hella high. It's like 10 and then I got lowered. I think now it's like 3 or 4, so I don't know if that's good or bad. I honestly don't know a lot of stuff about computers uh, and technology. Like what I know now took me a really long time to learn. Like, what the average person can learn in 10 minutes takes me, like, 30. Because I'm just hella bad with technology. Um, I'm a slow learner at that. And no Betty. I got Bettied. It was going to happen sometime. Whatever. Uh, yeah. Anyway, I hope you guys, like, like this World at War stuff. I mean, I don't mind playing Black Ops. I just need a break from it now and then, you know. I mean, First Strike, yeah, so five days ago. Um, I'll probably play that game more again when the map pack comes out. And I believe they're doing four map packs. So they've got three left, and I'll probably do, I'm guessing they'll release another map pack around April or something. That's my guess. Uh, early April, I'd say. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to that whenever it comes out. But, you know, you'll see Black Ops now and then. Um, I'm always down for some COD 4 search. And recently, I've been playing Modern Warfare 2, and that game's also a lot of fun. I know it's Modern Warfare 2, but if you just don't give a shit and you play the game just for fun, it can be a lot of fun. And you just don't care, you know. I think you need to play that game like drunk or something. I didn't play it drunk, but just let go and don't care, basically. This is what I'm saying. And the game's coming up to a close here. I see this guy at spawn. And you can actually sit at spawn pretty well and just hold out, uh, hold your own. Uh, I'm having like, I can't get this guy right here, actually. 
I don't know what it is about Japanese snipers, but you just can't hit them. Like, their hit detection's all funny and crap. Um, and actually, I remembered I had this little objective to bane at some guy before the game ended. Then I remembered at the very end and just went for it. And I got it. Final score 12 and 1. And I'm going to show you guys some trench gun clips. A bunch of nice three pieces and a bunch of other stuff. I have like a billion files to go through. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. And have a great day as always.